Today we celebrate the commitment being made between Eli and Chandler. Today we celebrate their love and their future together, but we also celebrate the covenant that they're making. Over the past 20 plus years, I have witnessed Chandler prioritize everyone else's happiness, but today we get to honor hers. She is the best daughter, sister, friend, aunt, and now wife that anyone could ask for. The truth is that everyone in this room is better for knowing you, Chandler. Man, it's been a journey, bro. It's been a journey. You love with everything on your heart, man. And Bro, I'll tell you what, that gets me going. That gets me going. It takes a real man to show their love, show their intention in life. So to be able to see you do that from middle school, high school, college, and on, it's been a blessing to see you. There is this overwhelming sense of love that has come over me today. I can't explain the feeling other than I know you feel exactly the same. I tear up at the thought of you walking down the aisle. <laughs> he said, ah, <laughs> it's wedding day, baby. <laughs> my future wife, my love, my lion, I love you so very much. Happy wedding day to the love of my life. I am beyond happy this day is finally here. You encourage me, you gently push me, to be brave and you never rush me to be any different. I am never going anywhere. I'm by your side through it all, baby. I love you so much, your wife. He is like complex in like one of the best ways ever. He is beyond like selfless and he feels so deep and he just wants everyone to be happy all the time. That's like his life goal is just to make sure that everyone is, you know, taken care of and happy and everything. She's taught me what love is. She's taught me patience. She's taught me beauty. She's taught me courage. And she's taught me how to lead as a man. Elijah's bold and he's free that he's his own person, his identity is secure. And that confidence, that certainty about him, that boldness, that freedom, that's a character of the Holy Spirit. That's Jesus was like, that's why people wanted to be around him all the time is because he had that kind of thing where he's ready to go. The kindness that is in this friend of yours, this daughter of yours, it comes out of her everywhere. She thinks about people and cares about them. And, and then if she cares about it, she's going to go after it. If she really cares, she's going to have the quick and clear conversations. And that candidness and that kindness is the character of Christ in her that drew you to her. Elijah, take you, Chandler. I, Elijah, take you, Chandler. To be my wedded wife. To be my wedded wife. I vow to be patient and kind with you. I vow to be patient and kind with you. To put your needs and desires before my own. To put your needs and desires before my own. To serve you sacrificially and wholeheartedly. To serve you sacrificially and wholeheartedly. To forgive you when you wrong me. To forgive you when you wrong me. To be honest at all times. To be honest at all times. To never harm or abandon you. To never harm or abandon you. To love and to cherish you. To love and to cherish you. In sickness and health. In sickness and health. Beginning this day and the rest of my life. Beginning this day and the rest of my life. In the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. In the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. I covenant to you my life and my love. I covenant to you my life and my love. They've committed their lives to one another, and acting as a minister of the gospel of Jesus Christ by the authority of God, I now pronounce them husband and wife. Elijah, kiss your bride!
first time, introduce all of you, Mr. and Mrs. Angeletti. So there comes a time in everyone's life where they meet their one true love, their soulmate, the person that's gonna be there and love them for the rest of their life. That moment came for Elijah about 21 years ago when he met me. <laughs> he and I have been through it all. I mean, literally, a few windows, some drywall. The one thing that stayed consistent though through the 21 years Elijah and I have been friends was his heart. I have the absolute confidence in the world Chandler Elijah is going to love you for the rest of your days. And even when that day comes, he's going to continue to love you. As she's grown up, Donna, her like, who do we see her Chandler with one day? What, what kind of husband do you think you're gonna have? She brought Eli home and we're like, man, they're a lot alike. They're a lot alike, you know, what, what's that gonna be like? And, and, it, and it truly has been beautiful. You love so deeply, selflessly, and unconditionally. And I know that Elijah is the best partner for you because I've seen him mirror those traits for you. No matter what may come your way, your combined patience, resilience, and love will make you an unstoppable team.